First on four, from minors to adults. Many who enter the United States illegally hope to one day become citizens here. Democrats and Republicans fight over the issue of immigration, which could have ramifications for Valley residents. CBS 4's Freddie Vela breaks down the continuing argument over DAPA. As the southernmost point in the continental United States, the Rio Grande Valley is a destination for many immigrants looking to cross the border. The U.S. Department of Homeland Security has estimated that over 11 million unauthorized immigrants live in the United States in 2012. And according to the Migration Policy Institute, 129,000 live in Hidalgo and Cameron County alone. On November 20th, 2014, President Obama signed an executive order authorizing the Deferred Action for Parents of Americans and Lawful Permanent Residents Program, or DAPA. DAPA was designed for the parents of U.S. citizen children that are here undocumented, so the parents never fix their papers. Just one month later, Texas and 25 other states filed a lawsuit to block the executive action. While the case moves through the legal system, the program remains on hold, leaving many across the United States waiting. And now the Supreme Court's going to hear the oral arguments April 18th. And, you know, it's going to take some time before they actually issue an opinion uh, and as to how they rule. But, I mean, that's going to be historic, you know, because if, if they reverse, you know, the district judge, then DAPA becomes a reality and you have all these millions of people now that are going to apply for immigration benefits. These are just a few of the requirements to be eligible for DAPA. However, the biggest one is not pose a threat to national security. I think the problem is stays the same. The problem is that we have an ever-growing population of undocumented good people. You know, people that aren't criminals, people that aren't here trying to defraud anybody, people that just want to work and want to take advantage of the American dream, they want a piece of the pie. But if they don't have the vehicle like DAPA to, for them to come out of the shadows and start contributing, start paying taxes, then, you know, it's, you're, you're missing out on all the revenue and all the different, you know, taxes and stuff that we can get. And you're also missing out on all these people contributing 100% to society in different kinds of jobs and careers and things like that. In 2016, many are looking to the presidential candidates for immigration reform. And while both Republicans and Democrats differ sharply on what should be done. Build that wall. Build that wall. Many in the Valley hope they'll reach a resolution soon. Freddie Vela, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.